Well, I just hit a mile in. Mile into what, you ask? A mile into my way up Mount Lacan here in the Great Smoky Mountains. I've done a trip up Lacan on video before via the Alum Cave Trail. This time I'm doing a much uh, bigger, more strenuous loop, going up the Rainbow Falls Trail, and then I'm gonna go down the Bullhead Trail. So it should be nice. I've never done either of these trails before. Never done this route up before. And hopefully, based off the skies, it's super clear. Maybe I'll get finally get a view from Lacan. I've been up Lacan like three or four times, and I've hiked up in the dark trying to get sunrise shots and everything else, and every time it's been completely socked in the clouds and I couldn't even enjoy the view. So I've never seen the view from Lacan, so hopefully that'll change today. Mingua. Seriously though, some of the best beef jerky you can get. Uh, I think it's made in Kentucky. I'm not positive. Yeah, it's made in Paris, Kentucky. Some of the best beef jerky ever. Uh, Jason from Backpacking with Jason turned me on to it and now I'm kind of addicted. So thanks for that. Oh, oh boy. So I took the Rainbow Falls Trail all the way up Lacant, went to Cliff Tops, finally got a view from Cliff Tops, like my fourth time up and the first time I actually got to see the view without fog. And uh, the plan now is I'm going to take the Bullhead Trail all the way back down to the car, make a giant loop there. Decide not to do Myrtle Point or High Top or anything like that, just to save a couple miles. But yeah. Down Bullhead. Never been on this trail either, and I heard it's good, so looking forward to it.
to where we were not all that long ago. Alright, so I made it back to the vehicle. Finally, that took far longer than I thought it would and kind of kicked my butt if I'm going to be honest. I, uh, the bullhead trail was really rocky and in really, really rough shape from all the burn. You saw the burn areas I was going through. Uh, really surreal going through those. Kind of a weird mix of being really cool and kind of really sad at the same time. But yeah, as a result, it took a lot longer than I thought. It was a lot hotter than I really would have liked and I ran out of water. <laughs> We have like three miles to the car and there's not a drop of water on the bullhead trail. So that sucked, but luckily I had a nice cold Gatorade waiting for me in the car. So that's good. That was poor planning on my part with the uh, water, I guess. But yeah, with that, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.